Hi, it's Joy, and today I'm going to be watching Marvel's Runaways Season 2, Episode 7, Last Right. I feel like this season is building up to this point at the moment. This is the halfway point. Episode 7 is like the middle episode, and everything seems to be coming together, and I can't, I'm so scared. I'm so excited. Let's go. Oh my god. What's Death happening? Fear. Death is not the end. Oh my god. I told your father I'd protect you, no matter what. Hmm. She was definitely manipulated from her entire life. Oh my goodness. That was an intense opening. Off to feed his dad. Trust someone to do the right thing and they... Yeah, it was your mom's plan. Don't. You killed 15 runaways? Don't cut the bullshit, Alex. We can rehash the past some other time. I'm trying to keep you alive. Well, I don't, need I don't think that's the way to get through to him. Okay. I've been down there with Jonah. Okay, they're all being honest. It's good. I mean, hard to process, but good. And we thought our parents were the messed up ones. He's been teaching me, explaining everything based on our technology, not his. Are you saying that my parents were stupid and that they died for nothing? Why would he have killed them if it wasn't true what they were saying? We're connected in this weird way on a deeper level. You can't trust him this much. And that's why you're staying. Leaving Carolina behind is kind of your thing. <laughs> No. Please stop fighting, guys. You were doing so well. You'll work through it, Karina. They'll trust you. Uh, sure. <laughs> People that work here must just be. Uh. Because I tried to kill him. <laughs> He's being honest. Definitely. Give him that. Who wouldn't want Jeffrey Wilder inside of them? I don't think that's what he meant. <laughs> I'll see you all tonight. He didn't answer her question. Didn't exactly answer your question. I don't want to agree with Rita Stein. Because this just turned into a rescue mission. I can agree with that point, but this is so very stressful. No offense, Mr. Wilder. <laughs> well, trying to save me, keep all of this from happening. So he could have another chance with you. Yeah. Which you don't deserve. Since he's there, then sending this to us now, that, that means it's all gonna work out. Not necessarily. It wouldn't be just the message if you were all gonna be a family again. And I hope she does not let them become a family again. Or if anything goes sideways, we have this. I don't trust Happy Victor. I'm gonna drop him. If this isn't gonna go smooth, there's too many contrasting plans. Oh my god. <laughs> America for you. The event is tonight. Religion and guns. Remember last season when she was ready to sacrifice Frank in the pod? Frank. What do you think in this restaurant with right, some kids bringing a man and a blindfold? Driving itself. Your entire journey can be a joyous It's a miracle. <laughs> oh gosh, it's all happening. Hold right there. Yeah, I got this. <laughs> but how long is he gonna wait before he realizes she's not coming? Don't tell him, he could have waited for a while longer. Because of you. You know, he's he's just gonna spiral again later. Don't trust it, Janet, come on. You're not going anywhere for number. One a year from my math. Whoa, everyone knows. Not everyone, but it's known. Don't hold this against me. Oh gosh, is Frank gonna get shot? Nope, he's gonna shoot Destiny's brother. Oh god. This show is just not hold back on the body count. This is like riding an elevator, but with no elevator. <laughs> Deep. <laughs> I don't like they're all down the hole. Can she file three of them up at once? We'll do this together. It's gonna be okay. I'm oh, I'm stressed. We have to do this. Am I hurting them? There's no other way. Hurry. <laughs> this is stressful. Oh god, that all done the hole. Oh my god. What's going on? <sighs> Initiate the launch now. Oh my god. But they're there! We'll service. Carolina can fly. That's all that matters. So the rest of them will get killed, but he doesn't care. Oh my god. Oh my god. We gotta go. I'm sorry, it didn't work. I can only carry two of you at a time. Take them. I'll stay. No, ladies first. I tell Green 
Oh my god. Okay, does someone need to just go now? Oh my god. This is so much. Guys, there's no time for this. It's beautiful and lovely, but later, okay? When everyone's safe and happy, we can do all the kissing. Can she take the star, fly, and then go up like that? I'm so stressed. Nico. Time to go back for Nico. I got your message. No. From the future. What? I know you haven't said it yet, but you will. It's so moving. Not the weirdest thing I've heard today. Whoa. I'm gonna need you. Wait for my signal. Where's I'm stressed. Oh my god, is it rising up? Where's Nico? Was that Nico? Flying with the stuff. Oh my god, that is awesome. That is amazing. Yes, Nico. Are there gonna be side effects from being in the box? She belongs with me! But I'm gonna find out here. It's her choice. I thought like Jonah's not gonna respect this choice. Oh god, it's coming. Jonah, you said there wouldn't be any quakes. Yeah, I may have lied about that one. Obviously. Okay, guys, you all had plans. Now is the time for the plans. Someone stop him. Is that a plan B? Full acceleration. Oh my god. This is not good. Oh god, all the plan Bs. Oh my god, it's like breathing and moving. Oh my god. Oh my god. I love them all working together, I'm so stressed. I mean the kids, the parents couldn't do what they want. So do we. Mommy! Oh my gosh. It isn't working. Don't give up. At least shoot Jonah with it. If you're gonna shoot anybody. Oh, he's gonna get mad. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, so stressed. Oh my god. Um, you all better run because if you've just killed his family, he's gonna kill you. Did you shoot Jonah with one of those things? Okay, while he's distracted, can you all run or take him out? Oh, Carolina. I'm sorry for you. And that's what we saw when he goes crazy in the beginning. All the decaying bits and oh gosh. Oh no. What you done? Oh gosh. You should have shot him with one of those things. He was more deserving than a few on the spaceship. Oh god. Run, please. Oh, Nico, I love you and I believe in you, but I'm also very scared for you right now. At least he's going for the parents rather than the kids. <sighs> I love you. <sighs> Is that enough to stop him? Is she worried for Nico or Jonah? That has the serum on it, right? So, so that should stop him. She did it! I don't know if I believe him being gone this early on. Oh my goodness. Oh, you did it's okay. Someone hug her, please. Now we're gonna have to take it all. Oh my god, no. He's not dead. Who are you? So was Jonah was possessing Oh my god, so was Jonah possessing just a random guy? So now Jonah's essence. Can you go into someone else? Sleep. Effective. 
so much has happened. I'm trying to process. That was epic. Oh my goodness. Aspirin, I hear that works. <laughs> Aspirin doesn't turn your finger orange, and that's like the best part. What now? Yep, what now? My dad's alive. Is that good? Good. Bad? Those concepts are starting to get real blurry. Yep. He made a decision that took everything away from me. He got a sister. You didn't have to kill my father, Nico. You chose to. Who is someone like Joan? I'm not sure what other choice there was. Delightful way to end the episode. So that was as big as I thought it was going to be. That was kind of the mid like smash of everything and trying to focus on everything that happened. So yeah, the kids kind of work with their parents. I think obviously they had the same goal here. And I think, you know, they can trust in their parents loving them, like each individual parent caring about their individual child, but that doesn't make everything okay. Um, I still think Chase is very mixed up over his parents, you know, like he shouldn't be happy to see his dad, but he is. Um, and the rest of them, that was the first time they'd properly, other than Alex, come up against their parents and obviously Carolina. So yeah, the ship, all of the creatures, all of Carolina's other family that were these aliens died. And we don't know if they were good, if they were bad, if they'd have done anything that, I mean, maybe there could have been a way that they could have left without destroying California, though it didn't seem like it. Um, I'm a bit annoyed that Dale and Stacey didn't fire at least one of those darts at Jonah. That would have at least stopped it being Nico. Um, but yeah, it was really interesting the way when Jonah died. Now, am I misreading this? Did I misunderstand that? Where it looked like he didn't know who she was and he had a different accent and was just a different person. So it was somehow Jonah, like, it, are these aliens, when they're normally aliens, just glowy light things? And then he was possessing a person, so therefore his glowy light could have gone into somebody else, or could be one of the parents, or even one of the kids, God, please no, or in just a different person who could come back in a different body, or was that Jonah dying and his essence just going whoosh. Um, but yeah, that, I have this feeling like we're not done with Jonah yet. Um, so yeah, I'm always going to be prepared for more to come with that. And the kids, they now think, as to the parents, that Jonah has been defeated and he's dead and gone and won't come back. So they now have to deal with the struggle of kind of, they were on the run from their parents with the added thing of wanting to stop Pride and stop Jonah. Well now Pride don't have any reason to do anything criminal. They've still done all the bad stuff. I'm not that, it, like they said, it doesn't make it all right. But it does mean that they're not currently an active like threat. I mean, they killed so many people that maybe they will be, some of them especially. But what are they going to do going forward? Are they just going to live on the streets for the rest of their lives? Are they going to have to just go home and get through the next two years and then leave and never come back? What are they going to do? Um, it's sort of uncharted territory for them, but I guess they'll take time. And I imagine the plot is not going to let up for them to just have time to luxuriate in this. But I'm very, like, I honestly have no idea where this is going to go next. And I love that. I have theories, of course, but oh, I feel like they're all being torn. You know, they've become such a strong unit. They can depend on each other, you know, even the people who were kind of the most opposite at the beginning now are really close. But at the same time, there are so many divisions and fractions that can happen even with a close group. Now, I'd like to believe that no matter what, the core six, and odd later, the core seven, will always find their way back to each other. If they have disagreements or fights, they can always forgive each other unless someone does something too far. Like, I think Gert and Chase can work through the relationship and get back together. I think the same... I do think the same with Nico and Carolina. Um, I can see why Carolina is upset that she killed Jonah because she killed her father, but he was a very terrible person. He had murdered a lot of people. He admitted that he was planning on letting the earthquakes happen and he killed Amy. I think why Nico, yeah, she chose to do it. And you'd like to think that, you know, good people will always make the choice of not killing. And I think if there was a way to not kill Jonah, that would be preferable. You know, if Jonah was just a human, who done all this bad stuff, putting him to sleep, he could wake up behind bars, he could wake up in prison. But Jonah, I don't know how they could have stopped him. And I do feel like the way he said, now we have to take it all. And then suddenly he had a different accent and he didn't know who Carolina was. Jonah is not gone. So I might be so wrong with that. I'm quite funny actually, if I just misunderstood that entirely. Um, I guess by the time you watch this, I will know because I will have finished the season. But oh, I just, so good. And I think, I hope Nico and Carolina can get through this because I think ne why Nico did it, you get it. You know, the rage you would feel in that moment. And we saw what she was going through, remembering finding her sister dead 
and you know he murdered her little sister of course she's going to be mad at him and he's not someone that you can easily stop so I don't know what else could have been done. I feel like if it hadn't been Nico, then, you know, he was ready to kill all of them. Oh, that was intense, you know. I, like I said, I, just, I don't know where it's going to go next, and I absolutely love that I don't know. I'm probably missing so many things that she'll be talking about right now, but I'm just kind of, like, in awe of this show and how much I love it. So I will leave it there for today. Thank you for watching.